There's nothing more romantic than fantasy. And we can make the war on terror distract them like videos and TV shows with scantily clad women, cover them with oil, rub it in like lotion, put F-16s in the skies and battleships in the ocean. The voters won't notice. Tell them you're either with us or you're against us. And in the same breath, over-vaccinate our soldiers. They'll want to believe these lies are the truth to the point that even Cynthia McKinney with proof won't be able to convince them that there's a connection between the war on terror and the Carlisle group. They'll need to believe these lies are true. I said over-vaccinate our soldiers and coat their ammunition with radioactive DU. Fear is the final frontier of the defenseless. If it's logical, tell them it's senseless. You're either with us or you're against us. It's all about confusion. Name it the Patriot Act if it acts against the Constitution. One man, one vote is a joke. You should be more concerned about your family being broke. Poof. Mirrors. Smoke. Now watch me raise spending and lower taxes. The answer to any question that the 911 commission might ask is, uh, we believe that stem cell research is immoral. North Korea has WMD's translation. Time for Operation Iraqi Freedom. Sacrifice American lives on Baghdad soil. Earn more from our investments in defense and increase our supply of oil. The question is, how come we haven't done anything about the genocide in Darfur? The answer is, uh, we believe in protecting the sanctity of marriage. Just give them a slogan. Let's roll. We're gonna smoke them out of their holes. Watch the hands. Watch the hands. And this hand, Osama bin Laden. And this hand, the World Trade Center explodes now. I know you want me to get them for you, but the $200 billion question is, how much is it worth to you for me to allow my cronies' investments in defense to work for you? Don't worry about what we knew prior to the fact about the attacks. That's a distraction. Carol Ann, look away from the oil fields. The important thing to remember is that voting for my opponent will get you killed. There's a connection between his election and your family's demise. That's why African-American voters have to be disenfranchised. Neo-democracy means the electronic voting machine companies get to help us decide. That way you can win the election and still lose. That's the new New World Order. Global economy, no borders, no sovereignty. Widows cries, corporate plutocracy. True lies.